Hey guys, it is Rock Before here in Siege World. I've never found Siege World before. I will tell you how to play it. And basically, it's kind of like Clash of Clans in Minecraft. So we're gonna. So, the, okay, sorry, I'm doing a horrible intro so far right now, but basically, it's kind of like Clash of Clans. You have to have a house, you build it up, you have to get the three main resources are essence, timber, and treasure. But I'm gonna. It's light team versus dark team. Most people are on dark team, so I'm gonna go light team. I will type in yes to confirm that. And let the venture begin. So, first we're going to go up to our king. And we're going to get our welcome gear. Which is basic. And then, uh, yes, you can sell your skulls if you get a skull off of someone. We're going to put on our welcome gear. And we're going to go, we're going to do slash warp. Slash warp. And then we're going to slash warp and then let's go to the market where you can just mine, you have to mine resources to sell them for treasure and different stuff so yeah here we are at the market so let's get some cobblestone I don't think I can get that though ah okay so we're gonna have to go to the wilderness first so slash warp and this is a new thing uh, it's been updated recently so slash warp let's go wilderness ooh tower parkour so that's where you can get some more uh Timber, and you need to have a certain amount of timber. Actually, oh, it's... Yeah, Dark has about 20 more players. Uh, yeah, so... Let's just go down here. And get some, uh... Get some cobblestone for a pickaxe so we can start getting resources to sell. This is gonna be another series. It's not like a single-day minigame type thing. Here we go, some stone. Just get that and that slash warp, and let's go back to the market. Oh no, I forgot to. Nope, I don't want to. I'm sorry. I have to get wood. No, actually, I can get wood at the market, but whatever. And this is where you can build your house out in the wilderness. So don't need you. Let's get some wood. Turn that into some sticks so we can make our pickaxe okay so we are now will warp to the marketplace so it's really cool there's an enderman transport system there's a war zone there's a lot of different stuff so let's look for a workbench there one is and there's also a lottery where you can get different resources as well so I will try that today I'm pretty sure it's everyday type of thing okay so now we need to look for iron and the only way to get emerald, which sells for 500 treasure, is to first get uh, a diamond pickaxe. So that's what we be looking for. And if you see like uh, blue slime, the blue slime is let's see, get get in this timber. Probably go to a different place. There, I got one. I got one piece of oak wood. Yeah, go over somewhere else to find uh, resources. Yeah, that's the lottery person. Uh, all the cobblestone is regenerating stuff. I need to eat. And melons, I'm pretty sure you can break that to get food. And this is my first time playing a full series. Or, not series, but a full time on this. So, hopefully, I won't do it very awful. Where are all the resources? There's gotta be some. Oh, there's some essence! Ah, oh, we got it. I will come back when I have found... Okay, we have found some iron here. One. And you automatically get the resource... Ah, oh, the diamonds are gone. Two, and he really mind the iron. Iron is like not even worth. Is there some more iron? Oh, it's just gold. Come on, I need one more piece of iron. Regenerate. Please. Please. And there's also control points, which give you a certain um, amount of resources if you control them. So if we do control points. Oh, Dark has them all. That is not good, but it looks like. I don't know. Oh yeah, we're capturing. Okay, so we're capturing essence. You can see right there the percentage is going down. So let's go back to the workbench, craft an iron pickaxe, and start mining diamonds and gold and all that good stuff. And then we can sell it for more money. And then we can buy a house. Hopefully that will be something to do this episode is to buy a house. Oh, that guy has a good little spot over there. We'll come in here put this to regenerate and hopefully this isn't random cobblestone oh there we go there's some good uh... iron's not worth mining is it? no i don't think it is 
A lot of iron here, so where I should have come before if I knew this place existed. Yeah, and a lot um, the more expensive materials are, I'm pretty sure that's how long it takes for that to happen. I think it just gave away my position though. Gold is 25 piece, diamonds are 100 and emerald. Very rare and very good are 500. So if you do SB player, we have zero treasure because we haven't sold anything yet. So, if, oh, I'm gonna go to these. Oh, no, damn it. No, uh, oh, I, no, I didn't get it. Nope, didn't get that either. All the diamonds are going. I believe, yep, I can get some timber right here. Like that. They're really just farming that. Ooh, essence. Nice. Got some essence right there. Um, more timber can't hurt. Let's see. I could get some melons if I wanted to. So if we do slash sell, I'm going to keep the diamond for a diamond pickaxe. Put that there. Sell the wood. So 150 treasure. Ooh, ooh, why can't I sell my timber? Ow. Wait, what? Someone just hit me. No. Slash sell. I want to sell. Yes. There we go. Plus 60 timber. Okay, so next we still need more treasure. And different stuff. I think if we could go for some. Ah, uh, is it still there? Essence. Es oh, it's gone. So I think, you know what? Why not? We'll play the daily lot. Oh, it's disabled. What? Ooh, diamonds. That is nice. Gold. And diamonds. Uh, no. Yep, got it. I thought the, first, the witch was a player trying to steal it from me. There we go. Some nice gold. Scoop up that timber. I think you have to have like 2,000. Uh, you need to have essence, a different amount of essence, gold, or essence treasure, and. Uh, timber to build a house. I need about 2,000 timber, 15,000 uh, treasure, and yeah. So I think I will go and make a diamond pickaxe right about now. So I can mine emeralds if I spot any. Uh, so the crafting bench is at the top right here. Yeah, like I said, today's goal will be getting the house and then I can show you guys what the house does and all that. Oh, it's storming. Storming, storm a brewing, and there's custom enchants on here just like there is in factions. But we get down the sword. Don't think I want to do that quite yet. Uh, yeah. So I don't. I think I'm gonna keep the iron one on me because you never know when you might need it. Essence, nice. Oh yeah, this is where I get my iron, and I didn't get any of that. Oh, this is all okay. This looks like good stuff. Mind that. The main thing you want is uh, diamonds, though. Diamonds, emeralds. There's also a war zone, which I may or may not go to the first episode here. I think I need to get some better armor. Any diamonds here? I don't know, but I want to go see. Uh, I'm going to get some food just in case. Because melons aren't the best food, but. If they're the only food you have, then. And you can see some people in regular leather gear. That's because they died and lost their welcome gear. But you, there's a cooldown on it, so you can't always get the same good leather armor. I say good, but it's pretty bad. Huh. I need to find more treasure. Okay, so we've just captured the lumber mill and... Okay. So if I do slash warp... Is there a warp? Ah, uh, there's no... Okay. I don't know my way to, uh the war zone around the war zone to the different places but and the daily lottery isn't working right now I've scooped up some resources but look like it's going to be a while before we look at that 500 timber nice um yeah so I'm almost there I want to go see slash warp and then let's go to the throne room to see how much it costs I think it costs quite a bit. We might go into the war zone and follow some nicely diamond armored friends. Uh, don't need that. So a house costs kits you have to get from the shop. Eight warps, skulls. Ooh, that's good. Whoa, house. Hundred essence. 
not anywhere near that. Thousand timber, pretty close, and two thousand five hundred treasure. Wow, that's gonna be a while. So I think I might. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna go around here, grind a bit, and then come back when I have my house ready. So guys, look who we have found and who's gonna be joining us on the series. We have Papos. Yay! So we are both noobs at this, and we both have enough. I helped him get some more resources, so now we can both buy a house. Oh, it was only two. Oh yeah, that was right for everything. Okay. It takes one minute to build, and then so I type in a zero six nine one. Four. Five, I believe. Yep. So now I have my home bed. Did you grab one as well? Okay. Uh, yeah, I got a home. Okay. So uh, warp to wilderness. Wait. Type. Wait. What do you? Nine, one, oh. Yep. Five. Two. Okay. So now I am in the wilderness, somewhere very far away. With this guy's house. Just right, right, -click the bed. right click the bed onto the ground. So it's kind of hard to play this multiplayer, but uh, so you yeah. Construct your house this close to your oh, he's sneaking oh, right there. Yeah, uh, okay. Wilder. Oh no, it's gonna build its house on top of me. No, gotta get out of here. And you want to upgrade your walls like this guy has wood walls. You start as dirt walls and different stuff. It's kind of hard to do this multiplayer, like I said, because your houses aren't near each other, and that's what you're going to be working on. But yeah, we can do episodes together and apart. Whatever we can do off, uh, probably going to be off camera a lot working on stuff. So it's really cool to see your house build and stuff. You know, I'm just going to jump in, and hopefully, I uh, know I don't want to suffocate. Never mind. Those are my beautiful dirt walls. Find each other. Uh, coordinates, but like I said, I don't have coordinates, so that's an issue. Uh, but, uh, yeah. When should I get on my thing? Okay, so my house, I think, has been completed. I How really want to find you so I can make my house. Um, I'm in a spruce tree biome, that's all I'm going to say. That's all I can say. Oh, that's a big house. Yep. Hey, we'll work out some wood nice. No longer hermit. That is right. I have like nothing I really need. So this is our um, house manager. He's called. So he will help us with all of our things. We have our crafting table, furnace. Um, up here we have nothing so far. This is where mo um, some of our stuff will build itself. Same with over here. We got cool stuff. The bed. Of, you can see I've already stored. Some of my junk in here, and then some more stuff up there, which goes to the roof, which I don't, there's nothing up there right now. So, I will buy a lumber mill, so I think, so stone, ticks and trips and church. Blacksmith 2 to get diamond armor. Cross season storage, this will be really cool. Um, you get the ender chest, which will, so I could, if I had really good um, diamond armor, I could have it for next season. We want house upgrades, right? Rooms, farms. Uh, let's go rooms. Here it is. Siege room. We don't need. We need more stuff first. Armory. I don't think I need that yet. Fantasy room. Ooh. Blacksmith. I need armory three first. Where's the mill? I would like a like a mill, please. Treasure room. Maybe I think mill might. Oh yeah, because they're different sides of the room. Um, house wall. Ooh, I could do walls, but I'm not going to do walls yet. Farms. Yeah, here's stables. I don't know if we're going to do stables. Ooh, here are the iron mines. Okay, we need a mill level one, so we're going to get that. Five, six, eight, six, zero. We have purchased uh, the mill. Uh, how long will it take? Two minutes, so we're not going to use glory on that. So, have you got your. Oh no. Have you got your my house, house yet? Is in front of my eyes. Isn't, isn't that cool? Yeah. So this will be done in a few seconds. And uh, oh no, I want to go back to my house. Thank you. See you guys when we have. So now my mill is here. Look at this cool stuff. So this is my mill man. He's my man main mill. So I need more treasure. Uh, a bit more treasure to do level two. For, it takes half an hour. So 
And yeah, so the, every five minutes, oh, five every minute, okay, that makes more sense. So we can collect stuff from that. I don't think we have enough stuff to get our uh, iron, because I think I want to do an iron farm right now. Oh, I can do that. I have gold. Oh, I need iron mine. Okay. Let's go 477055. There we go. This will take so half an hour for that one as well. So, how about we end this up by storing all of our good stuff in a chest and going out into the war zone? Don't die. I'm gonna go with a wood sword and eight melons. So, it doesn't matter if I die. I'm just gonna hunt with the pack, so. Uh, tell me when you're ready, and we will head out into the war zone for our last thing of the day. Yes, I am alone in the war zone. Popos has decided to get some more resources, which is perfectly fine, because, yeah, he needs to upgrade stuff just like I do. Do some off-screen stuff, get the iron mine going. I don't think I'm going to upgrade iron, because I don't know if it's really worth all that much. Definitely going to upgrade, uh, oh, I'm, better be careful, I'm in the war zone. Upgrade gold. So I need to find a bunch of friendly, uh, light players with full diamond and enchanted armor. What? What? Was that just fall damage, or was I being... Yeah. Okay, let's see if we can find treasure cave or something. Oh, I should have brought a pickaxe to mine stuff because you can find stuff in here to mine and all that. It's actually one of the best places, and the emeralds are a lot more common. Ooh, I'll get this stuff so I sell right away. Ooh, I cannot do that. I want to find treasure cave. That would be really cool to find that. Is this? I feel like this might be lumber. No, because there'd be more players around it, yeah. Um, okay. I think next episode I might upgrade my walls just because we want to have at least diamond walls when the war period starts. Apparently there's a lot of uh, salt about hackers. Whoa, what is this? This is, I think, some type of dungeon. Let's do SB War Zone. I could type War Zone. Screaming Wind Tower Parkour. Okay. Come on, what sword to protect me? Oh, that's that's creepy. Whoa! Oh, that's okay. So that's a nice essence right there. Some more of that. A light player. That's that's good. Hope he's not being. I hope he's not running from something. That'd be scary. Really scary. Some more timber. We got a lot of timber in here. Not that I, I have a lot, and I have a mill going as well, so. You know what? Just not a bad resource to collect. I want to find a dark player with nothing on, which is basically what I have, but. But that isn't even a wooden sword, I guess. I don't know. It is basically me. No! That is not good. I haven't even found one of these places. I'm just going to follow this path. It's a bad idea. And there's also, like, um, a thing against... <gasps> oh, I thought that was a head for a second. Because you can sell heads for lots of good stuff. Friend, we will go. I found a friend who is in leather, but at least he has leather armor. I'm too scared to... You... Oh, man. I'm dead. I'm dead. What? I am dead. I'm going to run away for a bit. What? There's a full enchanted diamond light, uh, dark player. Oh. Slash warp. I'm home. Oh wait, he wasn't even chasing me. Yeah, well, that's, I've had enough of the war zone. So now I can sell my my goods. 260 timber. That's it. Let's see if uh, how much this has given us, and then we will wrap up the first episode of Siege World, which of course the IP and everything will be in the thing below. 25 timber. Okay, that's really bad. We don't have enough treasure, so. I'm going to do some bit of grinding off camera, upgrade my walls maybe and all that, but yeah. So see you guys later. It's been a fun experience and we'll have hopefully a very good time today and for a while at Siege Wars.